Hello people, it's me again, just doing another video on my Astra. And this one, as you can gather, is to do with if you upgrade from a TID, a BID to a GID. And basically, as you can tell, you see I've got the three tabs up there, this is because the GID has been set up to use a mobile phone portal. Which is, I do have it, it's just not connected at the moment. That will be done in a little while. And I just thought I'd show you a little something that I discovered. That these things are sort of changeable. Now, if you have Opcom or Voxcom or whatever you call it. Focus. All right. If you go down to... Oh, there we go. Go to the... Thing me Bobby. All right. This is only if you want to put one of these screens in to get the trip computer functions and what have you, but you don't want the Bluetooth or you don't have the Bluetooth. You can do so if you go down to programming and where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Program variant, I think it is. Yeah, there we go. Right now. If I can, if you can read that, if it focus, it's not going to focus, is it? Mobile phone, portal, or phone. Now that's the thing you need to change. There we go. Right. So if we change it, oh. To go all the way along to select. No, if you go not present, no, and you program it, these changes will change your place. Now, if we look at the screen when I do it, it will go off, come back on, and you'll see a difference. There you go. Now you see, you've still got the trip computer stuff, still got the radio stuff, but the Bluetooth has gone. You also can change things. If you go back into the program variants and go to the next page, you'll get all this stuff. Now, Mine doesn't have electronic climate control. This, the car it came out of did. Basically all that does is if you have it, you put it on and you program it. This is where it don't work. Okay, and program again. Off it goes. Now, you see the box at the bottom. That is where your electronic climate control settings will be. Or showing your little, I don't know, what little pictures of chairs and things, what settings you've got on. That works both with this and with the portal. So, I'm going to put that out. I'm going to take it out again because I don't have it. So, we'd, I'll put the module for and portal back in because I do have that. I just need to connect it. And I'll take out the climate control. You can take out the board computer, but I don't really see the point because that's one of the functions, one of the features people want. So we program it again. And there you go. The climate controls have gone. I've got the Bluetooth back at there. Oh, where is it? There. 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 Bloody stupid thing. So. That will leave me so I can use them and such like. And yeah, that's about it for that. Thought I'd just show you if anyone wanted to do it because it doesn't seem to be. There always seems to be videos of, oh, look at my lovely upgraded displays, but no one actually ever shows you how to set them up. So I thought I'd take a leap of faith and I would do that. Anyway, let me know what you think. I've got a couple of other videos I'm going to do. Okay, bye for now.